These guys need to go. Oh my god. Okay, we'll see. Ah, look at this. Come on, come on. Friendship! Friendship! Okay, we'll throw that away. There we go. I don't know, maybe that's a huge mistake. Meat hook? It does pull us forward. But it just puts us right back in formation. That'll knock the loathing down. The spoils. Ooh, that welcome back, darkest dungeoners. I'm your host, Get Good Fox, and I am driving the retry ride, hopefully to victory. So we got an interesting choice coming up. Uh, let's go ahead and just get this battle with over. But like, we are gonna have to think about how we want to plan out our road battles. But at the moment, you know, all we can do is drive on. Wait, 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 wait. No. Okay, we'll see. Ah, uh, look at this. Come on, come on. Friendship. Friendship! Oh, right off the bat, man. I think that's a good sign right there. So, oh, no, that's just a loss of Moran. That's just, that's fine, that's fine. The landmarks do something about our, oh, wait, we're just. So he just did scouting for us. That is awesome. Okay, like I said, though, uh, we we don't have any choices here. We're gonna, we, there, there's a battle coming up and that's just the way it works. No decisions to be made here. So let's go ahead and take it. The Towering Feast. So this should be a battle with the... Um, so all of the previous battles have been, you know, duking it out with guys on the road ambushes. No, no, we're fighting. We're, we need to knock the loathing down. We're fighting it out. It looks like no matter what we did, we would have lost something. Okay, so they're bringing one good, one tough guy and two Wimperonis. I think the strategy here is to... Wait, wait, wait. We got to go through the checklist. First one, battle status. Enemies are making us more prone to being debuffed. So uh, we can cut that back a little bit. Uh, two, check the tur the timer. You know, no time limit. Uh, we need to use an item and we check the turn order. So he's going next and then we're going. So let's... I think he's going to go for a buff. That's the call I'm going to make here. So I'm going to go for the ounce of, prote of prevention. And we get to knock one stress off. Okay, he attacks. That's fine, though. Oh, it pushes him back. Interesting. Um, let's just continue attacking. Like, I, I, Let's get rid of these wimpy guys, because he seems to be something of a supportive character. He's like, he's like basically a supporter fighter. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and... There we go. Let's just get him out of here. Very low-level attacks. Really not good. In fact, they might not even be able to use their main ability. Let's return to the front. Reforming our ranks. And we get a uh, one charge of blocking. It doesn't really matter if he pushes her back, as she's effective in every rank. I am going to... Guard up, I think. There we go. We are at the ready. Oh, well, there's no time limit here, so, I mean, nothing's saying that we can't just hack into these fools. All of us get to go, so that's fine. That should be enough to deal with him. More free stress heals? Unfortunately, I need it on me. What are they doing now? Oh! Ooh, oh man, a plus two on the strength. Let's go ahead for the uh, the blinding gas. Yeah, might as well. He does resist. Let's check his resistance. I mean, it could have just been unfortunate. Okay, so his resistance is only 20, so it was just unfortunate. Oh, we were supposed to, yeah. We don't need to use the I mean, we should be using the stimulants. In fact, we're gonna have to toss something overboard, so I am just going to... I don't know. Let's embolden somebody. Maybe we can pick up some uh, friendship by buffing people. So because we get extra damage, I think I'm just going to go for the Throne Dagger. Actually, the Throne Dagger only does one more damage on the bottom. In other words, Throne Dagger does 3 to 5. This one does 2 to 5. So the only difference is that the Throne Dagger, the minimum damage is 3 as opposed to 2. So, Oh, 75 Blight Resistance. Never mind. We'll take it. You've got no one to buff. What are you going to do? Inhuman appetites. He eats a corpse, which is, I guess it's going to let him enable a powerful skill. Interesting. You know what? Let's just use some of these. 
Yeah! Now you're taking eight damage. We should probably get rid of that. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and prevent him from doing that a second time. Actually, I don't think I need to. No, I'll do it just to be safe. That brings him to the front. He is a big target, though, so we should still be able to... Nice! That's what we needed. We needed it from that person. Let, let's go ahead and just use the sting. Oh, I can use it on other people. You? Sure. What are you up to? 11 damage. An unavoidable end. I'm, I'm taking the shot. BAM! Um... He's very resistant? I don't know. Ounce of prevention. Maybe he has a debuff. We don't know what his super attack is. Oh my god, it does so much. Bilious Cannon? Okay, it's damage, blight, and a stun, which, like, that's... We can easily handle that. It's really not that big of a deal. He's down to death's door. And uh, if we can knock him out here, we won't even take the damage from that. Nope, he does. He, he's holding on. And can we tap him out here? Actually, yeah, let's just tap him out here. There we go. Pretty clean. That'll knock the loathing down. The spoils. Ooh, that, okay, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm not pointing at it yet, but that sure looks like something the leper would use. So we got one mastery, we got eight money, we got, um, so we got eight relics, eight of the other money. Disarming dagger, apply, oh, it's a dagger. Um, a 15% chance to cause blinding on hit, that's interesting. And then a curing cuppa with blight resistance, very interesting. Okay, so... We knocked it down a bit. Uh, what are we going to do? Oh, wait, 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 wait. We used some items. Let's go ahead and equip some items. Um, let's give you... Wait, we gotta go to combat. I'll give you this. Um, I feel like somebody should be using the healing items. I would like it to be you. You can use the healing item. You can use the ladenum. Um, that saved some of our room, but we're gonna have to dump something else. Um, gosh, what do I dump? I might dump some of the food, to be honest. I think I'm gonna dump the bread, because I, like, cheese and apples, I think those are pretty good. So we'll dump that, and, oh man, this stinks. Um, I don't think I want to go to the Sprawl next, so let's go ahead and dump that. Anyways... Here's where we gotta make a, a decision. We need to win two more battles. So that means if we take this path, it's gonna go... So basically, we have one battle here. And uh, if, we, if we're willing to fight these cultists, there's gonna be one, two, three, four chances to win. But you know, that could be pretty rough. That could be like a lot of damage. But uh, so it looks like, no, I don't have a decision yet. We're obviously gonna go here, so we don't need to think about it. So let's just continue on the path. Because we definitely know that um, we, we just have we, we we don't have any major decisions just yet. Although we are running out of flame, so I might want to think about. They emptied their larders, forging themselves as the world began. Wow! From Talk about the blockade right off the bat. Okay, let's get rid of him first. I think. Low blow. The slow suffering begins. All right. A uh, heal? Didn't need the heal, but, you know. Let's get rid of him. He's the guy with the lighter health. I think I want to do some preventative action here. Although, the blinding gas, they have a... Their debuff is pretty low, so I feel like we could just go for um, blinding gas. Okay, good. Finishing blow... Once again, not super worried about it, considering she does have self-healing capabilities. Um, we'll attack here. Attacking on... Oh, looks like we tanked the hit. Okay. 
Will we catch and miss? No. Okay, didn't pay off, but you know, oh, we got a stun. Wow, these guys are these guys are fighting pretty well. What? If, okay, you're taking six damage. You're burning out next turn, so let's go after you next. And then I'm going to. I don't really have an option because I'm pretty sure I want to. Unfortunately, I can't do poison darts in rank one, which is aggravating. We need to continue attacking, though, so I'm just going to attack over here. Their turn. Attacking a little bit of everybody. They're kind of distributing their damage all over the place. Okay, he hit on the low end, so that was fine. All right, I'm going to go for... I don't think we get any heals off of this. So I guess we're going to take the ounce. Actually... I think we're going to go on the offense. Like, I want to make sure that we get that... An unavoidable end. Okay. I need to move back to the front. That front mortar really, really set us back. to finish this quickly. Okay, so I don't... All right, let's see how we can get these guys down. We got four damage. This one, we might actually get this guy out of here right now. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take, oh. Okay, that's the end to him. Not worried about her health, but I might take the, um... no, let's keep going like this. I want. I just wanna make sure that we're definitely, get... cause like he's gonna take the tick on this turn and the tick on the next turn. The slow suffering begins. Okay, he's gonna do the finishing blow. Oh wait, okay, this is my chance to actually, um, I think I might guard here, because maybe I can get a tick of friendship. Maybe, you know, not, it doesn't seem likely, but also his finishing blow will be greatly reduced. <laughs> yeah, boy. Oh, I got a second attack, jeez. Um, I kind of didn't want a second attack. And the reason for that is because I don't want him to die yet. Because I, I, I want to get my Dead of Nights. Um, I'm just going to, I don't know, guard somebody. Maybe we get some friendship. Nope. Okay, I, I won't do that. I don't know. I'm just going to use some of these abilities. Um, Here, just throw, throw a thing. Do a thing. We burn the grave. The grave is burning. Okay, let's get our dead of night. There we go. How much do you have? You're going to take... Well, let me make sure he ticks out. Six damage. Okay, yeah, we can take our heal here now. There we go. And um, I don't think we really need to worry about any of that. He's, he's going away. Like, he has got four health. Yeah, he's going to burn out, so. There we go. Got a little roughed up there, mainly due to, like, the, that front mortar really moved us out of position. Ladenum, very useful. I do want to keep that. I might have to toss something overboard, though. Oh. Oh, yeah, we got to toss something overboard. Uh, let me check my characters. Um, can I stack some more on there? Yes, I can. That's still not going to be enough to make much of a difference, though. I forgot to use some heal. I should have used some of our our um, our heals there. Um, I don't know what to throw over. It it sucks so much having to throw all this stuff over. Um, I mean, maybe we don't care about disease resistance. I honestly don't know. Okay, we'll throw that away. There we go. I don't know, maybe that's a huge mistake. Okay, so where do we have to make our decision at? Nice. Oh, another friendship point, very nice. 
Where where are we? Where is our where is the cart even at? Okay, here we are. The towering feast. Okay. I think we're gonna take another fight here. Okay, uh, we don't have a choice. So this is gonna give us some buffs. That's fine though, because I, I wanted to take the fight anyways. Uh, looks like a fairly normal fight. I don't think it's, it's nothing too exceptional. As long as we stay in formation, I think we're gonna be fine. So who do we want to get rid of? No, okay, like the checklist, no special effects. We get to make most of our moves first. Who do I want to get rid of first? I know some of these people do take advantages from... I think I want to get rid of the lady. I believe the lady does have a special attack. Oh, wait, look at her. These guys have a lot of blight resistance. That probably doesn't matter, though. Because I don't think I would not throw the poison darts anyways. So let's... Let's just go with this. Yeah, we'll take the lady. I think we'll take the lady out first, because like, I still don't know these enemies well enough to really have an opinion on who we should be at the... Oh, great, awesome heal. Focus fire over here. Larval slop, I believe that is a... Yeah, that is for... Um, I'm going to go ahead and start getting my defense charges up. And I am going to... They do a lot of... I know I, I know that they cause a lot of bleeding effects. So let's go ahead and get our resistances up. We can rely now it's their turn to answer. Okay, we resisted one. That's great. Okay, we didn't resist that one, though. I gotta remember, we're gonna use our... Um, we are gonna use our crazy abilities. So let's probably throw another knife at the lady. She's down to four health. And I, yeah, I don't see any reason to not continue pressuring the lady. Although I believe she does go to death's door. Maybe I'll start working on the maid as well. Yeah, I think that's a pretty good idea. Okay, over here we've got... I think I might... Let's take an item here. Welcome relief from caustic agony. And then let's take a blind. Okay. I want to make sure my charges stay up. So I'm going to block probably over here. That's a miss. We'll take it. Larval slop. Okay, he got through our uh, he got through our uh, our resistances again. Unfortunately, um, oh, I get the move. So I they get to make two attacks. So I think I'm going to bring my guard back up again. Actually, it will be overkill. So I'm going to do this. I'm just going to rally myself and get the the minus two stress there. Meat hook. Okay, good. That means uh, she didn't get pulled forward. A carve. Okay, let's see what we got here. Um, that's eight damage per turn. Let's knock that off. This wound, at least, has been tended to. These guys are very resistant to blight, which is not which is not what I want. So I'm probably just going to spend a turn getting back into formation. Um. You have 50 Blight Resistance? I'm just going to throw a knife, I think. Although, they all get to move next. Maybe I'll take an Absinthe here. Because I am expecting, like, a, a bit of a counterattack from them. Okay, let's continue stacking up the... How many turns? You have one turn of it left. Um, okay. Three... Well, you're not going to die, so it doesn't matter now or later. Like, it's just overkill damage. So let's just continue stacking up the fire over here. Six damage per turn. Nice. She's down the death's door. Okay, moving us around a little bit. That's not too big of a deal. 
Um. Oh, we got two more attacks coming in. So I think I want to guard back up. I don't know if I want to take every single one of those attacks, though. So I'm probably going to... I want to guard someone, but I basically... I want to get more charges in case they both focus on me, but I also don't want to... I don't want to... I, I would like it if they they made, if they made attack separate people. That's good. A little bit of distributed damage. And we got to resist. There we go. That's actually... That was the... That was the ideal outcome. Okay, now it's time to start thinking about getting our health back. I was hoping to have a body... But that doesn't appear to be the case. It looks like most of us get to go first, so let me just get you out of here. Um, I believe I need to re I need to get my charges back, or I could make an attack. No, the, so I was thinking maybe I would collect a heal, but I'm not going to be able to. Basically, like basically, uh, they get to attack and then I get my heal, so I'm probably not going to do that. Who goes next? The maid? Actually, yeah, I think I will do that. I don't remember if the maid goes to... Okay, the maid does not go to death's door. Can make all the difference. I'm going to take a blind here. Okay, distributing the damage, that's fine. Suffering begins. Oh my god, they got through it. Both on his side and on her side. Okay, so now we can start regaining our health. Like, there's kind of like a little bit of a weight on it, but let's go ahead and start healing up. Um, okay, all of us go next. So let's get back into formation. Dead of Night. Ounce of protect uh, prevention. Cooperation is the key. And they're not going to be able to attack her anyways. So I'm probably just going to. I don't want to take a full hit, so I'm just going to guard up. That's a miss. I don't know why, where that miss came Oh, his accuracy. That's where it came from. Steady yourself. Perfect. Okay, let's take another dead of night. So now like, we're in the process of like recovering our losses. Take the heal. And now we can begin with that. A burn. I probably should be attacking those guys just because, as I said, she isn't very good at attacking the front rank. A slow dissection. An unavoidable end. Not able to, not able to cleave into the second rank. Pulls her forward once. Not too big of a deal, though. I'm going to begin attacking over here just because... Actually, let's... I, I'd rather do this way. Even if it's a resist, it's not that big of a deal. I do want my uh, charges back, though. Okay. So we don't have to suffer the eight damage because we can easily just cure it off. Impeccably timed. And now we can go here. Oh, he resisted the burn. How unfortunate. These guys are very flexible in their ability to hit in, in all the different ranges. Fortunately, their back rank attacks, they don't do a lot of damage. Okay, we'll take the stress heal. Cutting through my armor. Like, we need to get rid of these guys, so I'm just going to start attacking aggressively. Like, the, the, the bleeding ticks are going to start becoming, like, too much of an issue, so we just need to start attacking these guys out of here. We need to get this off of us. Anything, even if we get any blight at all, I just want all of it. I want them just out of here. Full offense. We need to get these guys out of here. Unsteady stances. Exhaustion takes hold. 
And we should be able to do it. Okay. One less obstacle in our path. Okay, well there we go. We'll take it. We'll take like a friendship. A bit of a rougher battle, but you know, I think I think our comeback part with the um, I think our plan of allowing the grave robber to get attacked in rank two is working fairly well. Looks like we got a little bit of this and that, so we're gonna have to dump some stuff overboard. We do get to knock the loading down. Investors. Um, crap. Let's see what we can do here. I know we used up something. We used up something. Uh, let's put more of these herbs on. Oh, we didn't use anything else, though. Um, let's get rid of this pouch of lye. Because we also... They use the corpses, but so do we. Um, max health. Darn. I like a lot of these. A lot of these are just really nice. Um... I don't know. Like I said, I don't even know. Like I feel like we don't get diseased that often. So let me swap this out for blight resistance. I don't even know. We'll take one of those off. Um, these are going to go on to the retry ride. Ten bleeding resistance could be useful right now. But like I don't want to lose the. Um, I do like the unwavering standard at the moment. Maybe ten is not good enough. I don't know. Okay, so I feel like we are a little bit battered at the moment, so I think we're going to have to bank whether we win or lose on either this or that. So let's go ahead and also we do have to be concerned that we are running out of torch, but I don't see any other way to regain our torch. Like, I think we just, what we have is what we've got, so we do need to knock out the loathing to its lowest possible Otherwise, we are going to suffer a cultist ambush. It looks like most people want to go this way, so that's that's what I wanted to do as well. So we'll fight that battle, and that will bring the loathing down to its lowest. And hopefully that'll keep our torch going. And if not, you know, if we do have to fight a cultist ambush, we know that, like, it's not... They're not unbeaten. Like, we, we have fought cultists before. But we, we can take it. Your path lies through them. And so they must fall. Okay, so it looks like we don't have the option to fight them. That's just the way it works. So we are going to get a friendship here, and it doesn't matter which. So I, I wouldn't, I didn't want to lose that much money. That's a lot of money we just lost there. But unfortunately, like sixteen, that kind of hurts. Um, so I guess the question now is, we need to knock the loathing out. So I'm going to go over there. That is the big plan. Where, where does it... They want to go... But yeah, we'll take this way. What's our torch? Torch is at 35. We, if we could just take out this... Um, if we could just take out the loathing, then like I think that the torch will be... I think the torch might make it. Inventory is full. Okay, we already we've already revealed everything. You know, we can't reveal anything more, I don't think. Here we go. They revel in debauchery, debasing themselves in the face of the end. Okay, I want to fight it out. Uh, she's gonna start with stealth. What does that mean? They get to start with. What is that? What does that even mean? I don't even know what any of this means. Let's take it though. Let's take him. We gotta knock the loathing out. Okay, this is this doesn't look too bad. I'm pretty sure we need to knock out these goats, though. I think they're gonna be our primary target. So let's begin. What are the goats? They have 55. They have a lot of blight resistance, so I think we're just gonna begin like this. A she on the other hand will begin burning. Over here, let's get our ounce of prevail. Let's do it blinding, yes, actually. There we go. It's their turn to respawn. That's perfectly fine. You see the 12 damage reduced quite a bit. Meat hook. It does pull us forward. But it just puts us right back in formation. Very wasteful attacks for them. So that's per. Ow. Man, that does a lot. We cannot. They, they just cannot be allowed to do that. Like, I just cannot afford to take 14 damage. These guys need to go. Oh my god, what an attack. 
uh, return to the front so that she, because uh, she's got to at least be in rank two. Yes, yes, staying alive. Oh, yes. Bleeding attack. You're out of here because you're next in line. Oh, I forgot to check to see their advantage, but it is a... Our, our, we're more vulnerable to, like, bleeding and stuff like that. Not enough to get through our ironclad defenses. Let's go ahead and raise this up. Empowered. Emboldened. We do carry ourselves well. Um... I don't know, maybe we'll just get lucky and get a... Like, I think we should focus on this one because it is in range of our... What do you call it? It is in range of our bleed, uh, of uh, the man at arms, so we are able to focus fire. In fact, that's probably what I'm going to do. Okay, we blocked it. I get two attacks. Here comes my response. Wham! And if that wasn't enough, wham! Ten damage altogether. Very nice. We'll take the blind. Come on, miss. Oh, he, he gets through. Not the deadliest of attacks, but, you know, we don't even need to take a dead of night. Uh, so maybe we get lucky and get a blight. There we go. He's taking seven damage, and he's got eight health, so we need to tap him a little bit. Uh, or we could just let him tick out. It just depends. Uh, I will get my armor back. Okay, no, we're not going to. Now that we know he, we know he's going to tick out next turn. Did we... Oh, I guess we didn't take the uh, the hit on that. Let's keep attacking. Oh, that stinks. Um, I'll, I'll just do his thing, I guess. There, I, I... Fox did... Oh, wait. Fox will just do this then. Messy. But effective. I'll take the heal here. Now, who's going to say no to 10 health? The burn. We need to, like, remove some of these so that... Okay, there we go. Now we need to not remove that because then we won't be able to attack to that rank. So let's go... Actually, I could have just done picture the face there. That probably would have done a bit more. Tipping our hats. Take the stress heal. Uh, let's just focus on getting this guy out of here. Come on, give me a blight. Nope. Um, burn. Resisted the burn, but I guess he's vulnerable. Oh, was that the thing that we, we equipped that's doing a thing? 12 damage due to the vulnerability. Yeah, he would be out to a tick next turn. Meat hook blocked. And this should be the end of him. Boom! Man, look at us. Great health, great condition. An inkling of potency still and a whole bunch of things that we're just going to have to relics. throw overboard. Oh, it makes me sad. We don't have cargo. That's the end of the loathing. We've got 23 torch. Let me see my map. We got one, two, three paths. Can 23 torch take us through three paths? I have no idea. I guess we're going to find out. Um, get rid of the chalk dust. Um, what are we going to do? Did I? I don't think I used any items. Uh, no, 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 didn't use any items. Um, crap. I don't know. I really want these clotting poultices, but... I don't know what to do with these items. Uh, maybe, let me check. Maybe we have a crummy item that I don't want. I kind of want the dark impulse. Um, that thing sucks. It's only 10%. Let's get rid of that. 10% is for wimps. We want 20%, um, 20 more, 20% more health. Hmm. I just do not know where to go with these. It's really just... Maybe we don't need this much blight resistance? If that's the case, let's just swap these out, I guess. That stinks. Anyways, um, there we go. So, we... It's all based on this. Whether we get our road battles, it's all based on right here. 
and then it's going to be pretty smooth sailing because you know like these are all like we can you know like we're, we're probably not going to do much fighting because there's not a whole lot of there's not as much value to fighting because our packs are basically full maybe we could get a mastery point but we want to make sure we knock out that road battle to fulfill this condition and then just take it home and go to the next run anyways let me know what you think down in the comment section like the video if it was entertaining subscribe for more dankus dungeon content and of course remember that you don't have to be good to get good.